Hit Exchange Media Coverage, Hymns 11. Well, when people replace their PAC system, uh, there is the uh, necessity that they migrate the existing patient data into the new system. And a lot of the existing systems were not designed to deliver that data out uh, rapidly. Uh, and um, very often they get very seriously overloaded when we try to migrate data out. So uh, the sad story of conventional data migration methods is that uh, it often takes years, uh, about a third, a quarter to a third of the amount of time it took to acquire the data to do conventional migration. And by conventional, I mean query the system one at a time for, for the imaging studies. To do faster than that, you need to reach inside the old system and that means specialized software for each type of source system. We reach inside the system and are able to migrate that data much faster. The other aspect of it is, is the DICOM interfaces from legacy systems um, do not export all the proprietary features of it. And the thing that we're finding increasingly is that people are interested in exporting annotation that was stored in proprietary formats inside the legacy system. So we also have the ability when we reach inside the system to pull data out that was, uh, for example, physician annotation that was uh, provided for uh, the using proprietary tools in the system. Catch the premier issue of Hit Exchange Magazine or visit hitexchangemedia.com for more healthcare technology news and information.